We are getting new information tonight on a chaotic scene in Phoenix. Yeah, Sky Fox over the scene yesterday morning where a man was found dead in his crashed Jeep. He had been shot. Linda Williams is live near 20th Street and Palm Lane tonight with more of what happened. Linda. This gaping hole in the freeway wall shows just how hard that Jeep slammed into the freeway wall yesterday. Now, what Phoenix police are telling us and through court documents is that that Jeep came from this neighborhood and that the driver had been shot. It began 430 Tuesday morning, Phoenix police say, when a father and son who live in this house near 20th Street and Palm Lane confronted a man in their driveway. They say he was stealing a catalytic converter from their Prius. In court paperwork, police say as the man, 27-year-old Patrick Pearson, drove away in his gray Jeep, two people opened fire. Detectives say Pearson was shot in the head and upper torso. His Jeep veered out of control and slammed into the barrier wall that separates this neighborhood from the State Route 51 freeway. Pearson died at the scene. In court paperwork, the father and son said they fired at the tires of the Jeep as it drove away. After investigating, Phoenix police arrested 22-year-old Augustine Chariz Romero and his father, 47-year-old Augustine Chariz Duarte, each facing a count of second-degree murder. They are being held on $250,000 bond and are due back in court next month. Linda Williams, Fox 10 News.